Hi, my name is David Burns. And my name is Teresa Finn. It was about 13 years ago, my son came to Martha Burns Swim School for instruction. David was his coach. We had, what, about 37 kids swimming, doing drills, and all of a sudden one of the girls came in and smacked her head doing the backstroke drill. Everyone came and looked, and I'm, as the coach, going, hey, what do I need to do to get you guys to do the backstroke right? Get you a helmet? One little girl raises her hand and she says, yes, please, we'd love to have a helmet. I'm like, there is no such thing. And that's when it went off. Idea day. If you look at the cap, it looks like a normal swim cap, but the technology feature really sets it apart. As you can see, it's a honeycomb design. It runs along the top, center, front, and back of the head. And so the cap protects the child or adult in the water. The standard swim cap is two millimeters thick. Offers We're, no protection at all. None at all. If you're talking about hockey, football, soccer, skiing, all those sports, you know, they have protection. And yet our kids go in the pool and hit their heads into the cement wall with no protection. We, we look at this as a movement. It's not just a product that's going to hit the market. It's to get these caps on all swimmers. What parent wouldn't want to protect their kids in the pool? It's not a matter of if a child is going to hit their head, it's when. That's and right. when they do, hopefully they'll be protected with hammerhead swim caps.